Hello, we are the Subnox project. We are developing a full stack of technologies for a global network of satellite ground stations. Ranging from the observations and scheduling server to the ground station instrumentation and everything in between, a team of 10 people are working around the clock in four different sub-projects. An overview of all different sub-projects can be seen here. Let's take a closer look at the status of each sub-project and the upcoming development. The Satnox network is a Django application built from scratch that implements a global management interface for observation scheduling, ground station discovery and analysis with public release of observational data. We have already a dev instance of the website with demo data up and running with all basic functionality like account creation, observation listings, ground station registration, etc. at dev.satnox.org. We are now actively working on the observation scheduling part of the code using the SGP4 model. We expect the work on Satnox network to be finished as a fully functional prototype in a couple of weeks. Related to Satnox network, we created Satnox DB, addressing the need for a global holistic database of satellite transponders which does not exist, let alone being open. We decided to create a service to crowdsource transponder information for all operational satellites. The service will feed data to Satnox network and client ground stations, but also provide the world with the transponder information in an open way with an API. The development is nearly finished and we already have a test instance up and running. Going down to individual ground station level, the Satnox client takes care of receiving observation jobs from Satnox network sending them to the ground station instrumentation for execution. It also takes care of recording the observation, decoding if necessary, and pushing it back to the Satnox network, making the data publicly available. Networking and internet access is also taken care at this level. The development of Satnox client is already advanced, with all basic functionality implemented on command line interface level. We still need to develop the functionality that pushes data back to network and possibly a web interface to enhance user experience. The actual instrumentation of the ground station is ready for deployment. We have recently finished the second version of ground station. The gear assembly is now polished, easily constructed and reliable on operation. The stepper motors are now stronger, the gear assembly more compact and the overall footprint considerably smaller. For electronics, we design, document and produce two PCBs around the stepper driver and the Arduino, having everything in a single board and an additional board as the power supply. Antenna experimentation is still underway. We now have moved in a much more advanced helical antenna design that complements the existing Yagi designs we have. All antennas are documented and instructions are available for construction. Development will continue for fine-tuning the antennas around the frequencies that are popular in satellite communications. We understand that supplying a full stack of technologies can sometimes be restrictive, forcing users to either use the full stack of technologies or not be able to use any parts of it. That's why in Satnox, we focused in modularity and implementing existing protocols. This has been tremendously helpful to onboard people with existing equipment to test sub-projects within Satnox with minimal setup time needed. All designs, instructions and documentation are available in our GitHub repositories where everyone can follow the development and contribute to them. We are really fortunate and happy to already have a vibrant community of contributors around Satnox from all over the world. We believe that keeping our process open and enabling the community around our project will be crucial for the success of Satnox. Keep following our updates and get involved today. Onwards we go!